Overbon is the um, uh, quant shop, really, uh, that sources a lot of capital markets data. Uh, we exclusively focus on fixed income uh, asset class, and uh, this particular asset class and the industry overall um, has a bit of a patchiness problem, unlike FX or equities. So we assemble a lot of that data and try to uh, come up with the um, uh, what we call street optimized view of fair value um, in terms of the pricing of the bonds and then also a suite of pre-trade indicators. Classic use cases are uh, systematic uh, pricing that enables more trade flow or uh, better portfolio rebalancing on the buy side. Fixed income uh, segment, as a class, as I mentioned, um, suffers from um, a lack of what we call consolidated uh, tape or a view uh, that it's a bit more centralized in terms of what has traded at what price amongst the counterparties that participate. That um, has particularly problematic uh, from a regulatory standpoint in the last uh, five, six years. Uh, because there isn't this um, uh, all-optimized view uh, in terms of the fair value pricing or best execution. And a, a number of kind of siloed solutions, vendors or uh, large counterparties have tried to build in-house solutions themselves. What we've identified as a strong trend is the automation and automation of the workflow and trade overall. But the necessary component to that is um, systematic pricing. Uh, or at least systematic signaling and some of the models that can enable that workflow. So that's where we uh, are positioned at, and I think that's one of the strongest trends in the industry in the next five years. A lot of uh, financial institutions uh, that we talk to, which are tier one sell-side dealers or tier one uh, buy-side portfolio management, asset management companies, um, have kind of a couple of choices uh, in terms of uh, build, buy, partner, or do kind of hybrid approach. Um, what we usually recommend, and we've seen a lot of traction uh, in that approach lately, is uh, to um, uh, engage with us to build a prototype. And we've created this sandbox environment where we can actually have structured data and uh, model components so that you can see the results, see it to believe it, um, and, and then deploy. And that greatly uh, reduces the time and cost in applying artificial intelligence modeling, which is novel and new to most financial institutions in this particular segment. Uh, AI expertise, uh, partnerships with uh, really uh, best universities uh, that are uh, specializing in uh, processing of uh, capital markets, uh, data, finance, and ML. There are um, uh, programs, uh, we just launched um, an R&D lab in Montreal, uh, partnership with three universities and Institute for Data Valorization. It's just one of the examples of how we harness the expertise of Canadian marketplace, uh, both in Toronto, Montreal, and across the country, in order to deliver uh, the uh, R&D uh, at the global scale. Now, obviously, uh, the community of startups that I think are thriving in Toronto community are also placing product internationally. And trip and mission to UK is one of the examples of how we collaborate in that approach.